Hello guys, welcome back to the channel Code Heroes. So today in this video, I'll be showing you how you can create an app through which you can upload an image through a button to Firebase and also show that image from Firebase to your image view. Now first of all, go to the tools, then select Firebase, then search for Cloud Stories for Firebase click on it and then get started with cloud storage java click on connect to firebase after that your web browser will open click on add project now here your application name should be detected automatically click on continue scroll down click on continue then default account for firebase and then click on project now while this is getting done make sure you like share comment on this video and subscribe to the channel if you face any issue contact me on contact me on instagram and i'll solve your issue there after that click on connect then open your android studio as you can see our firebase is connected now click on add the cloud storage SDK to your app. Click on accept changes. Now the Gradle build will continue in the background. Let's go back to our browser. Now just simply go to this URL. Cut the remaining part. Go to your project. Go to build storage get started select start in production mode click on next and then just click on done leave the settings as it is after this go to rules then remove this colon if false Click on publish and our images will be saved here in this directory. Now close the web browser and let's begin with our program code. Now I have already written the code but no need to worry I will explain it line by line and also I will provide the source code download link in the description. Now I will not waste much time in the XML code. I have just added a button and one image view. You can pause the video and copy it or check it for the reference. The ID for button is button upload and the ID for image view is image view. Now I have imported here some classes. You can import it while writing the program. I have created few variables, pick image request, then the button, button upload and also the image view as image view. Then I have created a variable for storage reference. Now I have accessed the button and stored it in button upload and same goes with the image view and again storage reference. Now this method is of Firebase and the this uploads this string is the name of the folder in which the image will be uploaded. This folder will be created when we run the program. And I have called this function here display image from Firebase which I will explain later. Now I have added an on click listener on the button and when the button is clicked open file chooser will get now in this function I have added an intent which will let us choose the image from the gallery this is the code for that and I have also set type to image so only images will be shown now when the start activity for result is executed our on activity result will be called 
and in this basically this two lines will give us the or you can say the location of the image which we have selected you can just simply copy this and the location will be saved in the image URI now I have created the variable file reference with the data type storage reference and I have passed a string as a child this string is basically the name of the image when you upload the image it will be saved by this name I have purposely added this specific name I will tell you the reason later now just file reference dot put file this method will be used to upload the image and I have passed the URI the location of the image and I have added two listeners on it one success and one failure so when it is successful it will show the toast upload successful and when it fails it will show the error message I have used the method e.get message to show us the error message as a toast. I have also added the method display image from Firebase on on success listener. Now comes the function display image from Firebase and again I have created the storage reference and I again I have given the specific name so now what will happen is that the, when the image is uploaded it will be saved as image.jpg and again we can access the image by that same name if we hadn't done that the image would be uploaded in any another name then we won't be able to access them that's why we have given this specific name and what will happen is that the image will get downloaded as a temp file in our mobile phone and then I have created a variable local file data type is file and then I am again getting the location of that file and if you look below again I have written get file method and I have added on success listener and again on fill listener now again if the get file is successful we can access image through bitmap as you can see the method decode file it will access the temp file and convert it to image and then it will display it in the image view see image view dot set image bitmap and then in bracket bitmap through this we can access the image and again if this fails the toast will be displayed with the error so that's all for the program now let's run this program on our android mobile and let's check if we get any issue okay a button has appeared let's click on the button let me select an image so now the image is getting uploaded yes uploaded successful and now the image has been downloaded and displayed in the image view also now let's go to the firebase as you can see the uploads folder is created and the image is present in it so that's all for this video guys i hope you like this video please like share comment on this video and subscribe to the channel if you face any issues just contact me on instagram and the source code link is in the description thanks for watching